Hi Taylor, my name is Rachel and I've been obsessed with you since the moment I heard Love Story in third grade. You have inspired me so much and I just wanted to make this video wishing you a very happy 24th birthday. Um, sorry, it's really cold and it's really cold where I live and what better to wrap up in in a Taylor Swift afghan because she makes my life brighter and warmer so there goes that. Anyways, um, Taylor, you've inspired me to sing, song, write, play guitar and ukulele, <clears throat> and not care about what people think about me. You know what? Your music inspires me so much and has gotten me through so much, I can barely stand it. You know, if I'm having a rough day, all I do is come home and listen to you, and suddenly, all my problems seem to fade, because I finally have a person in my life who understands and is like my best friend. Taylor, I've never met you, but literally I feel like we're best friends. I feel like turning to your music is like a therapy for me. Um, other people, they have boyfriends and all that. Me, I just, I'm just a girl trying to find a place in this world. Trying to be my own singer. That sounds stupid. Singer. Trying to be my own professional singer and you know why? Do you know why? Because you inspired me to be that. And, you know, other party people are going to parties. I'm just a girl listening to your music and baking cookies for your birthday. And for you to have such a big impact on my life is phenomenal because, honestly, I have no idea who I would be, where I would be in my life without you. And secretly, I think my parents feel that way, too. Because, when have I gotten obsessed with somebody who came out of, like, clubs at 2 a.m.? That's not my idol Taylor Swift. My idol Taylor Swift, she is this beautiful, amazing, phenomenal songwriter who expresses her feelings instead of getting drunk. Thank you, Taylor. I love you. Um, you know, it's good because I can share you with my friends and my family. And I feel you're so powerful through your words that you can even help my mom. She's been helped with some of your songs, too. And, yes, you do help my dad. He always complains to me how beautiful you are. And <laughs> he was watching the Victoria's Secret show with me, and he said that you hold your own beauty. And, Taylor, I agree with him 113%, because you are amazing. I saw you for the Speak Now World Tour and I had a voice. I had no voice the next day. And you made that the best night of my life. And then came two other tour dates for the Red Tour. You waved to me at B stage and I literally started crying when you came out and I was jumping up and down having the best night of my life in Columbia, South Carolina. Then I went to May 11th in Washington, D.C. That was phenomenal, too. Um, you know, your little quirks, nobody makes fun of you as much as you do. I love that you are open and, you know, you're not just one of those stuck-up people. And, um, you're, like, your guitar was out of tune that night, and you made a joke out of it. Instead of complaining, oh my god, my guitar's broken, oh my god, get me a new one now, you were just like... You were about to play Begin Again, and you just made a big joke out of it, and I love you for that. Like, to have someone who inspires me through her words, not caring what people say, that's made me stronger, and without you, like I said, I don't know who I'd be, where I'd be, and I certainly wouldn't be obsessed with a phenomenal person like you. I probably would just listen to random music like everybody else, but no, I have a special person my role model, my idol, my everything that I turn to every day. She kind of likes the number 13 a lot, and she likes glitter. And she's, she's so amazing. And if you're watching this, Taylor, I would probably die crying. Because my friend got in Club Red, and she told me that she told you about me. And you said that you loved me, and I cried, because for my idol to love me, I mean, 
it's just phenomenal because I love you so much. You have no idea. I love you to the moon and back. I'd do anything for you. I really would. Whenever somebody says something about you, I'm like on them. I cannot stand it because you have changed my life completely. Um, I've, yes, I've made my friends vote for you because you deserve it. And I created a Vine account because of you, because I wanted to be able to, you know, follow you and be like, oh my god, Taylor, I love you. Sorry, hiccups. And be myself, because Swifties, Swifties are kind of like the nicest and the strongest fan base in the entire world, because I love them so much, and Taylor, you, you aren't like some other celebrities. You treat your fans well. I'm just gonna... You invite them backstage after shows to meet them and say hi to them. Not everybody I know does that. I've heard many stories about meeting you, and I really hope one day it's my story. Because I want to meet you so bad. But you're flawless and perfect. And I've just heard that you instantly click with people and you're like having a best friend. You're like talking to a best friend. And you are my best friend. I have never had someone be there for me as much as you are through your music and your interviews. Your interviews make me laugh. Thank you for just being you. Thank you for being the same person like some people, not mentioning any names, change throughout their career. But you, Taylor Swift, you don't. You, you're phenomenal. You've just stayed the same person. And from the little girl I heard Love Story with, not little girl, you know what I mean. And with the little curls, to the girl who's growing out her bangs currently, like I am. I got bangs because of you. Yeah, they didn't look good on me. They look great on you. But I love your new hairstyle too. Don't get me wrong. Wait. I realize why I love it. Because it's you. Everything you do makes me smile. Um, you inspired me to make a YouTube account because I wanted to share the, with the world how much I love you. And your record label actually sent me birthday presents one year. Actually, it was this year for my 14th birthday. I'm now in 8th grade and have loved you since 3rd grade. So that's saying something. You... I started writing songs about a when I was 12, so about two years ago. I current, I wrote one today, and I write them about you. Honestly, I wrote a song called You'd Made, You Made Me Stronger, and it's about you, because you did make me stronger. I participate in chorus, and I'm there because I want to be a singer just like you one day. I want to be a songwriter. I want to be able to express my feelings like you. Because your words, honestly, sometimes you make me cry because your words, words are so beautiful and they're so like me, it's ridiculous. I sing your songs in talent shows because I couldn't imagine doing any other song. My room's covered with you. I will show you. Because that's all I want, is you. You make me feel better. Hey look, it's Keds. Yes, you got me obsessed with Keds. Thank you, Taylor. And you don't know it, but Meredith and my cat are best friends. And yes, that's a Photoshop picture. I wish it was real, but you know what? One day I'll have a picture of you and me in my room. Um, I love that your Twitter account, I don't have Twitter, but I love how your Twitter account is you. It's not, um, please vote for me. Please, um, you know, please do this, please do that. It's, um, applying lipstick on my... No, using my ca phone camera to apply lipstick, and it turned into this. And posting pictures of you with no makeup on except red lipstick. For you to do that, that makes me fearless, because sometimes I feel like, oh my gosh, I cannot go outside with no makeup. I was watching an interview of you, like, when you did, did that, um, 
no makeup cover shoot and you're telling your story about it and I was like you know what Taylor said it's okay not to wear makeup because everybody is naturally beautiful my personality probably wouldn't be the same without you I'd probably be like all the time I cry yeah I do cry everybody cries at least I think everybody cries everybody has heartbreaks but all I do sit down and write songs listen to Taylor it's all good to go you just blow my mind you everything you do everything you say it all takes my breath away like you're you're amazing you without you I wouldn't like Selena Gomez without you I wouldn't like Ed Sheeran without you I wouldn't know what kids were without you I wouldn't be obsessed with a little cat named Meredith. Without you, I wouldn't be the person I am today. Without you, I don't know what I'd be in life. Nothing, pretty much. You make me feel special, and you make me feel like we have a personal connection. I feel like I've known you my whole life. And, Taylor, if you're watching this by any chance, I love you so much, and I wish there was some way if I knew you were actually watching this, because I know your mom sends you videos of fans, and if you watch this, I'd probably, oh my gosh, I couldn't even talk. I mean, you've impacted my life so much, and I just need to tell you those things one day. I just need to spill my guts to you. I hope that didn't sound gross. But I just need to tell you everything you've done for me, and... Taylor, you're only getting brighter and bigger, and long live Taylor Swift. Happy 24th birthday. I love you to the moon and back. You're my role model. You're my everything. I've probably said that a lot, but you can't say it enough when it's Taylor Swift. My friends get annoyed with me because I'm like, oh my god, today's Taylor's birthday. Oh my god, yesterday Taylor did this. Oh my gosh. And they're all like, shut up. I'm like, no, I can't because she's changed my life. Yeah. And then a kid asked me the other day, was like, why do you like Taylor Swift so much? I was like, I don't have time to write you a novel today. I'm sorry. Don't worry. I've got really good comebacks. And nobody is going to mess with my idol, Taylor Swift. Because you've changed my life. And you're changing my life every day because you're amazing. And flawless and perfect. And I just wanted to say I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you to the moon and back a trillion times, or the highest number, because, like, Google infinity, triple infinity, zillion times, that's how much I love you. I'd do anything for you. Anything. And I just, happy 24th birthday, I can't believe, I've watched you grow since you are like, 18. I remember your 22nd birthday, I remember your 21st birthday, I remember you posting pictures of it. I remember you saying in a magazine that you weren't going to start being an alcoholic just because you were 21. <laughs> when I read that, Taylor, I was like, I have picked the right idol. She is not going to disappoint me. And you know what? She has never let me down. Turn on her record. And I think she stole my journal a few times. No, she probably didn't steal my journal. We connect. Like, literally, when We're Never Ever Getting Back Together came out, I felt like, so when did, what night did she sneak into my house and steal my journal? Because that's exactly, on the dot, 113% how I was feeling. I knew your trouble describes me. Actually, helps my mom, too. Mean. Oh my gosh. I can't even explain. I would scream that. I scream it still whenever I'm having a bad day because I can stand up to bullies because of you. You make me strong. And I just wanted to say I love you, Taylor. I've probably said that a lot. I'm sorry. This is, I'm, mm, I just love you so much. You're amazing. You're my idol. Happy 24th birthday. I hope you get everything you want because you're everything I want. And I really hope to meet you one day because <laughs> that would mean the world to me, and I've tried a million times, but you know what? 
as my friend Alexis says, if you think positive, positive will happen, I will never give up on meeting you because if I get all A's this year, my dad's helping me meet you, so I am working so hard. You have no idea, Taylor. I need to meet you. I need to tell you all these things. Your, re your record label is amazing, too. I love them so much. You have no idea how much you've changed my life. And if I don't turn this video off, I'm going to start crying, thinking of all the things my wonderful idol has done for me. So, I love you, Taylor. Yeah, you're my screensaver. You make me happy. I smile every time I see it. You make me smile. And long live Taylor Allison Swift. Happy 24th birthday, Taylor. I love you to the moon and back a trillion zillion times. I love you, my flawless idol.